Sports betting proliferation in Nigeria is reflective on the spending and growth in numbers over the years. The practice is unprecedented and popular just like football, which is the most widely followed sport in the country. With the advent of TVs, internet, and most importantly mobile phones, this has led to the betting industry springing round football where people follow sporting news and are kept abreast of their darling clubs in different leagues of the world. Sport bettors who stick at different pools may have experienced the high life from winning while plenty haven't been so lucky and losing it all. An entrepreneur in the sport betting industry, Honorable Akin Alabi, spoke about how sport betting business is huge and thriving because of the passion for football in Nigeria. Well, it's thriving everywhere in the world, not this part of the world. In fact, it's not thriving enough here. It's thrive, thriving more in the, in the UK, for example. So that's what we're trying to be like. It's very huge there. People still bet with very little money because of the economic situation here. So people bet with little money here, right? Understandable. So it's, I think it's thriving because we love our football. Um, the, the European football is now so big. Everyone has the club is supporting. The federal lawmaker also shares his thoughts on how the industry can be regulated and well protected. It's an 18 plus product. An 18 plus product is a product where over you need only adults like say alcohol and so on. You keep it away from children so that you can protect the industry. So if it's well regulated, well protected, then it's a very fantastic industry. The people like it. The government likes it because the companies pay huge taxes to the government for it and create a lot of jobs for people in terms of uh, staff working in these companies and even agents working with these companies. So it's, a, it's, a, it's an industry that, if well nurtured, is fantastic for the country. As an accomplished founder of a leading sport betting business, Alabi gave useful tips to aspiring sportpreneurs who want to venture in the industry. Business is tough in any, anywhere in the world. It's not easy to start a business. It's not easy to succeed in a business. 80% of the time, you're going to fail. Right? I don't care what anybody else tells you, you're going to fail 80% of the time. So the same advice you give a sports person is what you will give an, a, a nightclub owner or, or someone that wants to sell clothes or want to sell food or open a restaurant. Right? So because small business is dynamic, little things you can fail. There are many things to learn about, sport, uh, about, about, about business checking your market to make sure there's a market there before you start at all so that you just don't start the business for starting sake. With the sports betting industry growing and the explosion in the number of online betting providers, it remains to be seen the continued economic effect it will have on the Nigerian people. Isaiah Akiremi, IETV News.